boom. Here we go with a new wave oven. This is my first time trying it in my new living situation here. Um, I'm actually living in an extended stay hotel. Shh, don't tell nobody. But um, I got separated from my wife, very toxic person. And, you know, I just had to get out. I had some things going on in my living condition. And basically, I had to get out, you know. So, um, I'm, I'm situated now. And basically, now... I'm about to use my new wave oven for the first time. Um, I'm really pumped up about it. Let me show you how it works. How it works. A few smears on the top for my fingerprint. Bam. Pull it back. I got some pork loin, country style ribs. And we about to slow cook them. Let me show you how it works. Okay, so basically you just take this down right here. Boom. And then you... Do that right there, you know, the, the little heat vent right here, boom, boom, boom. You'll see that in action later. I'll, I'll show you that later after I start cooking. It's so cool. Um, I really love this oven. Um, let me let me show you, the, show you the dials. If I wanted to cook this quickly, I could do it in about an hour for the amount of meat that I have. The New Wave oven just does everything. You put the meat in there, boom, that's it. You know, I've already done all the hard part, really. You know, when, when you're handling meat, you got to be very careful with it. Clean surface, clean hands, then clean your surface, and then clean your hands, right? So, that's really the hard part. I mean, so it's really simple. Whether it's frozen or not, it can be frozen or not. And, and you're still cool. You can still cook with this, and your food will be cooked really quick. So, that's really the best thing about these ovens, and also it's healthier. As it says, live well, and, I mean, live well for less, right? So, start and stop. You can cook fish, steamed veggies, potatoes, bake canning. Um, on the other side, rice, multigrain, soup, meat, stew, poultry, and beans. So, this is pork. Um, they don't have a pork. So, that's something that I noticed. So, I think that's poultry. That, that falls on the poultry. I don't know a whole lot about this. I'm going to learn more about it and share that with you. But, um, I, what I do know is... What I want to do today is slow cook, so watch this. Boom. Slow cook and then start. Sorry. Bam. And now it's going to wait for about, it's going to warm up for maybe about um, 10 or 15 minutes. It's, it's, it's going to warm up. Then it's going to go, and it's going to start, you know. And so it's telling me about four hours, I think. And it's going to count down to zero and boom your food is ready but it's it's no big deal you know it's slow cooking four hours is a good time for slow cook but i tested this against my slow cooker and i'm going to do it again from what i remember the food tastes better in this than it does the slow cooker i can't remember or not but i'm gonna test that for you but um but yeah, um, but yeah, this is a really cool cooker, man. I really like it. So I just wanted to show you how you cook in a new wave oven. I did not season my meat because I don't have, I haven't purchased any seasoning, salts, or anything like that yet. But it's all good because I'm having barbecue. So when I pour the barbecue.